Hello everyone, this is Gamo Edits and welcome back for another tutorial. In this video, you will learn how to create this kind of presentation using the Morph Transition. So let's get started. So on a blank slide, insert a circle shape. So let's add the circle and place it in the middle of the slide. And to ensure it's properly centered, align it to the center and middle of the slide. Now change its color to white. Next is to add another circle shape beside the main circle. This smaller circle will serve as a text box for the elements, while the large circle will act as the main title block for the presentation. Now, duplicate the smaller circle 4 times. Make sure all the smaller circles are well aligned and evenly spaced around the main circle in the center. You can also decide if you want to add more circles or even delete according to your needs. Now for the next step, we will add some design. For example, let's add some icons here. I got these icons from the Microsoft PowerPoint stock library under the insert tab and then click on icons. For example, let's search here different icons, for example, the earth icon. And the next is to add your text. So I got this text for the description for each element. And here is our main title block, the four elements. Now. Group each element into one using the right click method or even use the Ctrl plus G shortcut from your keyboard. Now, select the main title block. This time, right click and then click on cut and then we will paste it as a picture. With this, we can easily adjust the size of the main title block. Make sure that it is properly centered. So let's click on align to center and align to middle. And we, we got to make sure that this title block is placed in front. So bring to front and then duplicate the slide. And let's go back to the first slide. And once we are in the first slide, we will select all of the four elements and then click on align to center and align to middle. With that, we just hide or move the four elements under the main title block. After that, we can also enlarge the main title block for additional transition later on. And finally, select both slides and apply the Morph Transition. And finally, here is the final output. This tutorial is made possible by the Morph Transition. As you can see, we have created a smooth animation that you can use with various elements in your next presentation. Again, this is Gamma Edits and thank you for watching.